So I definitely recommend spending at least the first six months focusing on your classes, your literature review, and figuring out exactly what that story of research is that you want to tell. Doing a PhD is a very personal decision. Um, it's not necessarily going to advance your career in the, thing, in the ways that you think, but it will advance, advance your personal knowledge and passion about an issue significantly. So uh, I think my recommendation is for PhD students to really think about what their passion is and remember that they're doing this PhD because they're interested in learning more about a special issue and that they're committed to that. Try not to um, prioritize the academics and at the expense of their personal lives and their relationships and their health because um, being healthy and, you know, and being stress-free will help you optimize your, you know, your life and help with your academics. Don't uh, limit your experience to just academics. Uh, getting involved with the Students' Association and volunteering in the community is also extremely valuable. Getting outside of our own experience and realizing that we're a wolf pack, not a lone wolf. and We don't have to do our degree alone. And there are so many ways that we can support each other and feed off each other and keep a, a positive environment. I'm Ima Anigum. I'm an MPH graduate. My name is David Schultz. I'm an MSc grad. My name is Jimena Ramos Salas, and I'm a PhD graduate. My name is Karol Lisowski. I am an MPH graduate. My name is Christina Velasco. I am an MPH graduate. And this is public health. This is public health. This is public health. This is public health. This is public health.